Now let's take a look at a case study. I want to ask you personally, how would you handle a situation like this? We've got a situation where a financial consultant has come into our company and we've uh, apparently, somebody in the department has set them up with an account on the finance server and they're not able to access it. They brought in their laptop. We've installed or, or somebody's installed the network software on their laptop, but we're walking the halls, a dangerous thing for network engineers to do, by the way. We're walking the halls and we get pulled in and we're told that this financial consultant cannot attach to the server. What would you do? Think about that for a moment. How would you approach an issue like that? Well, one thing I would do, I would make sure that that laptop could ping the server if we know the server's IP address. Can it ping it by IP address? Are we trying to reach it by name? Can we do name resolution? Is it DNS that we're using? Are we trying to reach it using a WINS server perhaps, using a computer name to IP address translation? Can we get to the WINS server? Yeah, I would make sure that name resolution was working if that's what we're using and that I had connectivity to that server. If all that works, then great. We know that layers one, two, and three are good. Then we can start investigating some of the higher layers.